My sister promised me once that she's going to give me one of the most amazing holidays I've ever had. And hands down, she succeeded. I had the most amazing time visiting Australia and its white sandy beaches. Picnic! Picnic, yes. Hi, buddy. My time in Australia was indeed full of adventures and I still cannot forget the beautiful sunset of La Perouse. <laughs> I had the most amazing time running across the beach with my sister. And not to forget the time when we were singing our heart out. And doing a barbecue in an isolated island and getting trapped in the forest was just one of the highlights of my trip. And my time in Australia finished with the most amazing New Year's Eve with my family and the surprise birthday party that was arranged by my sister and my friend. And I can't wait to come back to this most amazing country. Right in front of the Harbour Bridge and Opera House, waiting for fireworks. Um, it's 3 o'clock at this moment and we have to wait for like um, 9 hours for the show to start. So I'm really, really excited. And we are making, wearing matching dresses. We're calling a couple of friends as well, so let's see who's going to be able to join us. And I'm just going to eat my sandwiches that we bought. It's some lovely, lovely weather. And it's Bradfield Park. Really good viewing point. And we are in the front. Ice cream! It's all packed up now. And we are just enjoying our ice creams. My sister. Oh god, it has never rained in Australia on New Year's Eve, so that's one of a kind. Not at least in the last 20 years. I've never
us a note that we're going to celebrate her birthday. And we've got just this cake here for her that I ended up getting yesterday. I'm going to go to her house and I'm going to pretend um, that I'm taking them out for dinner. And then Hajra is going to help me take everything inside and we're going to surprise her tonight for her birthday. So I'm going on another dinner with Farel. Hey. Hi. And it's her favorite place where she has gone many times and she's you know taking me there again so it's, a, it's my last day in australia i'm very sad but i'm glad i had a really good time with my you know best friend and my sister yeah hi guys it's hajra aisha's sister please don't mind me i know i'm looking mess but that's okay the reason i came here is to tell you guys is that Aisha has gone for dinner with her friend Priyal and um, we are actually planning to celebrate her birthday it's a surprise birthday party she doesn't know that so she took her to dinner and uh, I have um, the cake and I'm decorating the house without her knowing anything so we'll see how it's gonna end because she's already very emotional, so am I, because she's leaving tomorrow and we're very sad because we had an amazing time together. And uh, yeah, so I'm just gonna do this to make it memorable for her. So let's see, it happens just to let you know, this is what's happening. We're like, you know, doing the balloons and uh, you know, Eliza is helping me out with it. Yeah, so I just did this much so far. I mean, still work in progress, so I'll keep you guys updated what's happening. And yeah, a little bit of music doesn't harm. See you soon. So guys, I'm back again. So I have done all the decorations so far. And all I need to do is to make sure that everything is... Um, all I need to do is to put the candles on the cake and put the candle on the stand. So this is what I've done. Can you see? So this is what I've done so far. So a little bit of nibbling is right there. So let's see. So all I'm going to do is to get ready, close the lights, and there's another thing I need to do is to put some songs. Uh, sorry, some pictures on my TV and background music that I've already downloaded. It's going to be a surprise, good surprise. Hi guys, welcome back. So I'm almost ready, as you can see. So I'm just waiting for my sister to come. She's having a dinner. It's almost done, ready. So she's uh, coming on. She's on her way. So um, yeah. So I'm gonna just put the cake because it's in the fridge. I can't put it now. I'm gonna lit the candles, and I've al already put um, you know scented candle to lighten up the atmosphere and uh, yeah and a little bit of that so it's going to be you know sorry uh, so lights are going to be closed so it's going to be just the lamps and um, I'm gonna put something really nice for Aisha to remember with this song on it so we'll see how it goes because I'm sure she's definitely going to cry so did so will I let's see 
how it goes with Aisha. I am super thrilled and super, super excited. She's coming. Really, 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 really excited. Guys, I am. Guys, I'm really excited and equally thrilled. So. She's coming in any other second. What's the surprise, Hajra? You didn't tell me. Uh, I, I found out uh, the twelve in, in in last minute. Last minute. <laughs> Hadra is going to drop me at the airport. I'm we're very, very sad, sad, but we had a most amazing time in 10 days in Australia. I so tell her to please get come back again. Yeah, we'll I'll go come to back. Gaines. But now you need Great to come. Barrier. Tell her. <laughs> now you need to come to London. Inshallah. Bye to Australia. And to my sister. And this is Hajra's 